All right, so you're a single woman. I totally get it. One of the biggest things that caused me great terror when I became single in 2013 was vehicle maintenance. I did not know how to do it. I didn't speak the language. Um, I was very overwhelmed by that process. Now I have a great vehicle, a reliable vehicle that I can drive, but also I have two others that belong to my teenagers that uh, they're just now beginning to where they can help with those kind of things. Um, but So I have three vehicles that I have to maintain as a woman and I, not a mechanic, don't have any history in it. What do you do? Well, the first thing that you do is find a qualified mechanic or place for car work that you feel comfortable at. Uh, if something doesn't feel right when you take your car in for an oil change, don't take it back. Try a different place. Work until you find someone that treats you right, that makes you comfortable, um, that listens to you, and uh, that, that knows what they're doing. So that's important, the first thing, find a good mechanic. The second thing is go online and Google your car and also maintenance requirement list. And it will pull up a list that tells you when things should be done to your vehicle so that you know ahead of time at what mileage certain things should come due. That way when you walk into an appointment, you're more prepared uh, for what they might tell you it's time for. Third thing, keep a little notebook just like this in every one of my vehicles. And in this vehicle, whenever it's serviced, I write down the date, the mileage that it was serviced at, and actually what was done and the location. This little notebook goes in with me at every vehicle maintenance appointment for that vehicle. Because what I don't want is the people to come back and say, oh, your brake fluid needs to be changed. And I'm thinking, didn't I already do that? I can pull out my little notebook out of my pocket and flip and find the date that it was done. And then it doesn't get done twice if paperwork gets messed up. And then the fourth thing is I keep a three ring binder here with all my vehicles in it and all the paperwork from those appointments. This would be my starting place to find out when I did something and then I could go to the, the three ring binder to find what was done, who did it, what, who the tech was, um, and any other issues that may have crept up during the service appointment. Get confident. The more you do it, the easier it gets. That first time is the hardest. But once you find a place that you're comfortable at, you know the services that are probably gonna come due. Um, you have your records close by so that you can look them up. All those things really help when you're maintenancing vehicles as a woman.